Automotive visionaries. And if we pull this off, we're going to make a major change in the way Americans drive and the footprint that we have uh, on this world. A speed demon fit for spies and celebrities. I think James Bond could be eco-friendly if he was driving a car like that. An instantaneous acceleration that will blow your mind. I am here in Silicon Valley at Tesla Motors with David, and we are standing in front of the all-new Tesla Roadster. Yeah, this is it. This is the electric supercar. It uh, does zero to 60 in about four seconds. It's got a top speed of over 130 miles an hour. It does all that 100% electric with zero emissions, and it gets over 200 miles on a single charge. Yeah, range has always been the issue with electric cars. This thing gets over 200 miles in one charge. This is really a case where you can have your cake and eat it too. You can have the performance of a Ferrari, but over double the efficiency of a Prius. An electric car like ours uses about half the energy per mile that the best hybrid car uses today. And none of that is oil. So from the perspective of the environment, global warming, carbon footprint, electric cars are the most efficient, uh, the cleanest technology you can choose. Uh, in terms of, of freeing us from our addiction to oil, they use none. Starting an automobile company is no easy task, and the risks are huge. So what inspired CEO and co-founder Martin Eberhardt to take the leap? I guess I started off looking for my next car. So I looked around and thought, Somebody must make an electric car that's really designed to be a performance car. And actually nobody was. And uh, the more I looked into it, the more I thought it was possible to do that. And also that I wouldn't be the only person in the world that wanted a car like that. A car that's, on the one hand, a great and fun and beautiful car, and on the other hand, doesn't burn gas in. There's no doubt about it. This baby's a real looker. But what about an option for those of us who don't have an extra 100K lying around? Let's check out an electric car that's on the roads right now and starts at an easier to stomach 13 grand. Mark Korchin founded Green Motors in Berkeley, California, and sells the 100% electric-powered Zen car. I think of the Zen as the Tesla for the rest of us. There's no special charging station. The Zen simply plugs in to any standard outlet and will recharge in as little as four hours. For every $5 that you spend in gas, I spend in about a dollar and electricity to go the same distance, so it's about one-fifth the cost. You'll continue to save money in the fact that you're not having to do oil changes, valve alignments, all of those fairly messy things that we normally do with our gas-powered car. This is a great option to get me around town, but I'm not convinced it'll take care of my need for speed. So let's check back in with Tesla. I still need to get behind the wheel. I've convinced David to let me experience the Roadster firsthand. Riding in the Tesla is an experience like no other. It's gorgeous, virtually silent, and it accelerates like a dream, all without using any gas. 